welcome to part 2 of diseases in passion fruit and in this series we're gonna be covering all root pests and diseases in passion fruit farming passion fruit is affected by both soil pests and diseases which attack the roots of the vine we will start with the diseases you have number one we have root rot disease root rot disease is a common disease in many areas or farms it is caused by pathogens which attack the roots causing them to rot the signs are shown by yellow leaves drying of vine which seems healthy but upon uprooting the stem is rotten from the roots it can be spread to other vines in the same farm if not treated control measures that are taken into place is where you uproot and dispose the affected vine away from the farm that will help to control the spread of the diseases in the farm we have number two we have root dry disease root dry disease is almost similar with the root rot disease only the differences is caused by changing the nutrients or ph in the soil if the change in the ph in the soil does not favor the growth of passion fruit it can cause drying off of the vine so mostly the perfect or the best ph to grow passion fruit is from five to seven these diseases causes reduction in production and also change in the color of uh, the leaves or the vine and sometimes if the conditions are extreme the vine may dry up number three we have root knot disease this disease is caused by nematodes in the lad which causes harm to the roots of the vine indications or characteristics of nematodes attack in the vine are root galls or knots yellowish leaf and stunted growth and wilting and eventually the plant dies or the vine dies to prevent affection of other vines you apply nematicides which help to control and kill those nematodes easy or example is markup in part two we deal with the pests that affect roots of passion fruit they are called root feeders some of the root feeders are number one we have moles or lodens these pests are found underground under the soil where they feed on roots of the vine and leaving only the hanging outer part of the vine they are controlled in two ways we have number one the old methods the old methods deals with applying of curing traps in the farm and number two we have the new modern or modern methods which involves control by killing them using a poisonous or rodenticides number two we have ants in some cases ants are held account for causing harm to the root of a passion fruit vine they can be controlled by applying anticides or doodoo -doo dust to control them we have number three we have termites these are known for eating the stem above the ground which causes the vine to dry hence they are controlled by application of 
tomatoids. Did you like this video? Please like and share with your friends. And if you have not subscribed, please subscribe. Thank you.